Elton neighborhood is a working class community where more than half of the households bring in less than $100,000 a year. A proposal to line these streets with power poles up to 95 feet tall has many here fighting the powers. I see less beauty. As he walks through its streets, Jeff Kelly worries about the future of his neighborhood. Another example of not putting people first. Snohomish County's Public Utility District is planning to build new power lines to meet growing demand. 45 to 65 poles up to 95 feet tall. Of the four routes under consideration, all run through the city's Delta and Riverside communities. People here worry the size of the project would mean losing land in their yards and toppling trees that in some cases include children's tree forts in this blue collar neighborhood. They're working a lot of hours and they come home, they don't have time to go to the parks, but they do have time to go outside to the front yard and to play catch or to um, just spend time with their children. The PUD needs to run transmission lines from its Everett substation to the Delta substation and the neighborhood routes are the most direct. Spokesman Aaron Sweeney says neighborhood concerns are being listened to. We're really, really early in the process of this, so getting that feedback from customers now is critical to helping us design that preferred route. <laughs> Neighbors think a better route would be to run lines down heavily traveled Broadway to have less impact on families. There's also the issue of demographics. Health department data shows the Delta neighborhood is less affluent than other parts of the city. Neighbors say people don't have the time to go to community meetings or talk with local representatives. They fear that could mean lights out for their quality of life. The people of Riverside and Delta will just have to make the best of a bad situation, which unfortunately has become all too familiar. A decision on the preferred route is expected later this spring. The PUD says it will then have more conversations with neighbors. The lines are expected to be installed in 2027. In Everett, Eric Wilkinson, King 5 News.